too low. Of course, the day that I decide to record is the day that people decide to make the most noise. Um, so I do apologize if there's a lot of noise around me. Okay, oh wait, let me just wait for that car to stop. <laughs> I am attempting to use a earphones microphone in hopes that it'll make the audio a little bit better. Um, but if it's not, I apologize, I'm sorry. But yeah, it is on my wish list to get a proper microphone so that my audio would be better because I do know that there's a lot of background noise most of the time. Okay, so, oh my hand. <laughs> there's a few things that I need to make um, commissions and things for friends. So I'm going to make a few items. Um, the one being a butter dish, kind of like this one. I'll put a little image there. A, ooh, drop my mic and another being a textured platter. Um, I've made the textured platter before and I've made a tutorial on how to make it as well, uh, which I'll link at the top corner. I think it's a side. No, it's a side. I don't know if my finger touching this mic is making it sound funny, but anyway, we move. I'm gonna start with those two things and then see how my day goes. Um, yeah, so that's, that's what I'm gonna be doing today. Um, yeah, enjoy watching this vlog and I hope the audio is a little bit better. And um, that is one heck of an ant. Oh, it's carrying another bug. Never mind. That's the end of my story. Thanks for listening. Thanks for listening to my TED talk. Okay, bye. <laughs>
and then by whatever this dimension was here nine and then i just made it a trapezium and i did the same for these sides i'm just gonna attach them all and i'll probably make like a little handle for the top Okay, so this is what I've made. I made, you saw me make that. And then I made this platter dish. And then I threw this on the wheel. I didn't record the platter dish, but I did record throwing this on the wheel. But it's for another video. So that'll come in the future, hopefully, if it turns out. Um, and then I've just been recycling clay. So you just mix the clay with water until it becomes a sludge and then you lay it out on a wooden board or plasterboard or um, anything that will absorb the water 
and then you just let it dry like that until it becomes the same consistency as normal clay.